The mule is a term used to describe the original reparations plan for the newly freed slaves at the end of the Civil War. After the capture of Savannah, Georgia, General William Tecumseh Sherman, with the Council of Freedmen Pastors and Abolitionists and the full weight of the Union Army, issued Special Field Orders Number 15, January 16, 1865. These orders divided 400,000 acres of land from South Carolina to Florida to be given to Black American freedmen of 40-acre parcels. The purpose was twofold. It provided a place for newly freed Black families to settle. Also, it was the punitive cost of war for Confederate landowners. This was just the first of multiple actions that followed during emancipation to attempt to make whole and provide means of self-determination for American freedmen families. Families whose free labor and suffering under the American Holocaust quite literally built the country. The most prominent additional legislation is the creation of the Freedmen's Bureau and Freedmen's Bank. However, after the assassination of Abraham Lincoln and the ascension of Andrew Johnson to the presidency, the special field orders and any legislative actions supporting American freedmen were 